Hello friends, coming to you after a run, finished a run up here in Sacramento. And I just <clears throat> taught a class today. I was teaching for eight hours today. And after I teach a class, I'm exhausted. I mean, I'm just mentally and physically drained, but I knew that I had to get this, this 45 minute run done as part of my training plan. I, so I know that if I drive back to the hotel after class, I'm probably gonna default to my lazy self and just lay down and take a nap, probably skip my workout. So what do I do to avoid this? I build systems in place to make the good stuff for me easy to do and the bad stuff hard to do. So last night I packed my bag with my, my running clothes and I had it in the car ready to go. And so I don't drive back to the hotel. I take my bag and I change in the car, which I know is weird, but it's okay, and get my running clothes on and then I go for my run. This is what I have to do. I have to, in order to build positive habits, is make it really difficult to do the, the stuff that's not good for me and make it really easy to do the stuff that is good for me. I learned about this in, in a book I've told you about before. It's called Atomic Habits by James Clear. And it's really a powerful book in teaching you how to build positive habits. So do what you can to put a system in place for yourself. Um, I'm weird, so I have to do this weird stuff, but it works for me. I just got my run done, I feel great. And I know that had I gone back to the hotel, I probably wouldn't have done it. Anyway, that's it for today. Take care of yourself and take care of each other.